Good evening, everybody. It's Crystal with Coffee, Crochet, and Cuddles. Happy New Year. How are you all? Haven't been on in a while. Oh. Blizzard. Come here, Blizzard. Come sit. Oh, yes. Oh, my goodness. Mm -hmm. Mama can't do anything without Blizzard, huh? Oh, Avalanche, sit down now. Sit down. Hold on. I just realized I talked for about five minutes straight and none of it was recording, so I'm a little bummed out now. I'm like, eh, I don't want to say it again. Okay, so I'm still working on my Ice Yarn 2020 Challenge. I can't show that yet, so we're not going to bust that out, but we can bust out this hat that I just finished, and that is a crystal bat from Bag o' Day Crochet pattern. She worked it from the bottom up. I was not able to do it that way. I just could not get my yarn not to twist. So what I did was I did standard increase out until I had enough stitches and then I worked it down using the same stitch that she used um, it is with a lighter weight yarn than what she used so instead of having 60 stitches uh, in this there uh, is a I used a four point uh, let's see I used a 4.5 millimeter hook, and I did 75 stitches. Somehow there's 75. I don't know how I ended up with 75 here in my increasing, but I did. And the reason why I ended up with 75 is I noticed that when she was doing these puff stitches, she was using three. So she was putting into one, skipping one, and putting into one. So it's like using three spaces. So... I figure it must be a multiple of three, so that's what I'm going to use. It seems not too bad. It goes on a little bit of a diagonal there, but I, I think it blends pretty decently. I tried to keep it <clears throat> nice. I'm trying to decide if I should make a big, gigantic palm for the top or just leave it like this. We'll see if I have any yarn left for that. And I'm working on, to go with it, a pair of fingerless gloves. This is the bottom, the wrist, the wrist part. So I'm working on that. And that's all going to go um, with the scarf that I'm working on, the ice yarn challenge, um, to my aunt up in Maine. For her birthday on January 31st. So I figured I have this 2020 challenge. Let me make something with it. And it's the perfect time to get it done by the 20th. So then I can mail it to my aunt. Oh, let's see. Do I have any other finished objects? Hold on. So Blizzard decided he must have attention now. He tried to get Mama to play with his toy. We can't play with toys right now. No. Uh, so New Year's. New Year's was quiet. I worked the day before and I worked the day after. So did I do anything for New Year's? Not a whole bunch. Drank coffee, crocheted, cuddled with my dogs. That's about it. Um, was actually sick right in the middle of Christmas and New Year's for two days with some kind of Bad stomach bug. You can still see my Christmas lights going. I do not take my tree down until the epiphany. So that's still up. That'll be coming down on Sunday around, along with the rest of my um, holiday decorations. I finished, my, finished the hats for my nephews. So that was what I was working on. Hmm. No, I don't think I've 
finished anything else. I can't think of anything off the top of my head. I don't have any resolutions for New Year's because I never think that anybody actually keeps any of their resolutions. Um, I think resolutions put a lot of stress on people and people tend to break them after the first month. They don't last long. Um, yarn band? No. Yarn diet? Maybe. Depending on how things go. Um, I'm not going to buy yarn just to buy yarn. Like, I just went to the Joann's sale because there were some really good sales. So I did go, and I did spend some money, but I don't think I went overboard. Everybody else would probably think in my family, oh my God, why do you need that? <clears throat> well, I crochet a lot. And as I've said previously, I will be starting... Hats and hats and hats and hats and hats and hats and hats for Lion Brand uh, and their hashtag hat not hate cha um, not challenge. They don't really challenge you. They just collect hats for anti-bullying. And since I was bullied as a child and I know what that's like, I am very passionate about that anti-bullying campaign. Blizzard's trying to be mischievous. So you will be seeing a lot of blue hats in the future. Uh, I'm not joining the Ardith Cow. I'm not joining the Temperature Blanket. I thought about doing the Crochet Crowd uh, Mandala or Mandala. Those are not really my thing. I don't, don't like big projects in general. <laughs> If somebody could make like a washcloth make along where you show like a new pattern for washcloths one one a week that would be perfect I would join that uh, I don't have that many scraps so there's no point in me doing any kind of scrap busting project or anything like that um sorry I'm saying I'm a lot I'm trying to gather my thoughts here it's getting late I guess my intentions is to just come on when I have the chance to say hello, check in, show you what I'm making, show if you I've show you if I've bought anything. Um, here's the um again. Hmm. And just have a great 2020 of crocheting and enjoying to meet. Oh. I do hopefully want to get to go to the, um, I keep saying, um, I gotta stop that. I do want to be able to try to go to the Niagara Falls, I guess Stitch Fest or, or whatever they're calling it. I have to try to get some information on that. I guess it's in April and I would really like to go to that. I haven't been on vacation in a while. Mostly because these guys are my life, and I can't imagine leaving them for that long. Hmm? What do you think, Beach? Huh? My goodness, the fur would fly if Mama left for that many days, huh? The fur would fly. But I think for a weekend, it wouldn't be too bad. My brother could take care of them while it's gone. Have a neighbor friend of mine come over and let them out too, in between. Any unresolved things from 2019? Unresolved. Um. Yeah, that yarn carousel. I have totally not washed my hands of it, but kind of because. Mm. Like I said before in a previous video, I just cannot stress out about it anymore. About where it is, who's got it, who's supposed to have it next. I set that up all earlier. I gave everybody the information that I thought they needed. One lady had it. 
and I haven't heard since from her if she sent it on or not. I haven't heard from the second lady if she's gotten it or not. So I really, really have just washed my hands of that entire thing, and I probably won't bite off anything like that until I'm much bigger, and I know who I can trust and who I can't trust. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, unresolved, unresolved. That's about my only unresolved issue from 2019. I mean, I just started my channel. I think I'm making good friends here, which is what I wanted. Connecting with people, learning new things, because I had never made a hat before in my entire crochet life. Until I found Crystal from Bagaday, and she made it so, like, it blew my mind how easy she made making a hat look. I'm like, okay, I'll, I'll try, and then boom, 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 I'm whipping out hats last year like they were nothing. Oh, that look, <laughs> that's stupid. It's not the Addy Express. I do not have the Addy, but I have something that's quote-unquote similar, and that thing... I don't think that's going to work for me. So, let me know in the comments if you think the Addy is that much better than the, the other loom knitting one that I've got. Because I, I, I just could not get it to not drop my stitches. It would drop it and it would be sloppy and all that. So, I'm glad I only paid like pennies on the dollar compared to the Addy because if I bought the Addy and that thing was doing that to me and I spent however much money the Addy is I probably would shoot it with my gun <laughs> no I wouldn't shoot it and my gun doesn't work because it, it hasn't been fired forever I have a little 22 rifle from when I was a kid uh -huh. da, da, da. so no resolutions, no big projects for me, no make-alongs, no cows, unless I see something that really I can't pass up. I like the ice yarn challenge that Glenda came out with because it was quick, it was simple. Don't have a lot of scraps, so can't do that. I will try to pop in and show you guys some more of those doors down in that storage thing because that kind of went by the wayside during my whole month of December vlogmas. Like I said, any of that type of thing, whether it's vlogtober or vlogmas or what, I can't record every day. It's just nearly impossible for me with my job and how many hours I work and stuff like that. And uh, some relief off my plate is, um, I'm not, I haven't said this to anybody on here, but, um, we did get approved for a mortgage to buy the house that my dad owned from the estate. That's where I've lived and took care of him for the past umpteen years. So, finally some relief, some stress off of my plate that we finally got approved for that so I know I won't be moving and I won't be going back over the road because it was looking more and more like I was going to be an over the road truck driver again that's it everybody I think that's all I can tell you for tonight uh, if anybody has the information for that Niagara Falls uh, Stitch Fest, if they could uh, message me um, in the comments below, and I will give you my email so you can send it to me. But again, enjoy your coffee, enjoy your crochet, and most importantly, enjoy your cuddles. This is Crystal. I'm going to say goodnight for now, and I'll be seeing you again. Bye, everybody.